Hey guys, it's Bonnie. I am... Ah, uh, hold on. Sorry about that. Hey guys, it's Bonnie. I am just finishing... I think I just finished about three and a half miles. I'd have to reset my clock to find out. Be running three and a half miles back on the way home. But I realized I didn't do a pre-slash-post race for Race for the Cure. Uh, race for the Cure went amazing. I went into this one kind of weary because Eugene was not my best race by far. Um, so I was just hoping to put together an okay stellar. I, okay, so I wanted stellar. But my goal was okay, just get back on track. I didn't just get back on track. I freaking shattered my 5K. Uh, last year, I ran Race for the Cure 5K in 2952, which for me was a major landmark because that was the first time I ever broke 30. Uh, this year, 2844. Can't say I'm not very, very happy about that. Um, first time I ran a 5K breaking sub nine miles all the way through, which is another major goal accomplished for me. I am just pretty damn happy. Uh, before I go into details, here's what you're hearing back there. I ran the raceway track trail this morning because I'm trying to sneak my run in between 5,000 other things I've got to do today. Um, gotta say, I am so freaking blessed to be a part of them. Team Wadey's Fuel. We called it Dedication Weekend this weekend. I realize I keep walking into the sun. And uh, we dedicated our runs to special people in our lives. And we did that in honor of Carol Kennedy, who yesterday celebrated 10 years to the day of her last breast cancer treatment, her last chemotherapy treatment. And any of you know that Carol has made a major difference in my life. Uh, basically helped me when I kind of started I, realizing I needed to get my life together and stop going down the wrong path. So it looks like everybody managed to do some amazing things. And you guys, my, my fellow Wheaties Fuel teammates, I love you all. Thank you so much for doing that for me. I, like I said, I've been blessed. These guys are amazing. They're inspiring. Also, kind of sneak in there, I got to thank Tony and Lee. Tony for keeping me in line with my running and helping me fix all those mechanical issues that were wrong. <laughs> and then Lee for her inspirational remarks and just kind of talking me through my Eugene disasters. Uh, to my friends on Team Bring It, you know I love you. God, I can't believe it's two more weeks and I'm running another half marathon. What am I doing here? I better get back on the road, so I will talk to you guys soon.